Hello everyone. I am sharing a case of granular dystrophy which had a recurrence uh, after 10 years of ALTK. So the edge of the graft is identified by scraping of the epithelium. So once the edge is identified, the anterior lamella peels off easily without the need of any sharp or blunt dissection. And since the lesions were deep, we decided to go ahead with dismiss bearing big bubble talc. A partial trephination of anterior lamella was done to, to debulk the cornea before injecting uh, air into the stroma. The aim is to remove about 200 microns more of anterior stroma. So the dissection was initiated by uh, sharp crescent. Once the plane is achieved, further dissection is done by blunt dalk dissectors. So by doing this, we remove about two-third of the anterior stroma, uh, thus leaving about 150 to 200 microns of posterior stroma, where we are going to inject uh, air to create a big bubble. A stromal track is created by using a beveled up 26 gauge needle. We then use a blunt air insufflation cannula which has a opening port at the bottom to uh, inject air which separates the decimers creating a type 1 big bubble from center to the periphery. A split is created in the anterior stroma by a 15 degree uh, knife and visco injected to separate the decimers from the anterior stroma. This is done so that uh, we don't rupture the decimers membrane while dissecting uh, the anterior stroma.